Hi, I'm Lee Merman with Investments in Sarasota, and happy 2019. The theme this year is making smarter choices. Today, I'm standing in front of the construction site of the new Ritz-Carlton residences being built in downtown Sarasota. Several of our clients have taken an interest in this property, which will come to fruition in late 2020. This year, I want to focus on people having good information about the marketplace. A lot of people ask, how is the market doing? In fact, it was the most popular question in 2018. Rather than talk about all of Sarasota's 725 square miles, where there's a lot of variation, I thought we'd look at just a handful of communities. Right behind me is the iconic view. The building that sets right before you go over the bridge to St. Armand's, Lido, and Longboat Keys. It has 141 residences. Currently, there are just two for sale. Out on Lido Key, the Ritz Carlton also manages the beach residences. There are 88 total units there, and eight of them are currently for sale. And just down the beach, there's the Orchid Beach Club. And there's only one for sale out of 55 specific units. And that one is listed for $6 million. In addition to understanding how the real estate market is, I think it's also important to understand Sarasota. Because after all, purchasing real estate here is actually an investment in Sarasota, in our community. The Ringling Museum has just completed raising nearly $100 million for its expansion. They are, their goal is to be a global center for global works of art and Florida culture. The Selby Gardens is looking to raise $92 million and they are well on their way. They are searching the world over for some of the greatest living treasures and they want to bring them here and preserve them for conservation efforts. In addition, we also need to know what the numbers were for 2018. Sales were up during this year 3.8% over the year prior. However, in the fourth quarter, sales decreased by 4.8%. October and November were up over the year earlier, but December was down. The distressed market decreased, which is, is another indication that our real estate market is healthy. It decreased by 18%. The luxury market was off 9.5%, and affordability decreased by 7%. I really believe that some of the weakness in our market in December is a result of the stock market in the fourth quarter of 2018. A lot of buyers and sellers became nervous when the stock market decreased by a lot of money since a lot of wealth is tied up in the, in the stock market. To that end, I think real estate is a very viable alternative for where people can keep some of their money. And it, when you're investing in real estate and that real estate is in Sarasota, I really believe that is a very sound investment. As we go forward in 2019, I think it's critical for buyers and sellers to get their hands dirty, to get out and touch and feel that neighborhood which they're going to either put their market property on the market for sale or in which they're buying. With good information, I think it's going to be very easy for buyers and sellers to get to their final de destination. In 2019, let's make smarter choices together. For Investments in Sarasota, I'm Lee Merman.